Guys, progress in the gym. Okay, now, every single time you come in, you have to do a little bit more than what you did before, okay? That is key. That, the people that make the most amazing transformations to their body are the people that can really implement that and make it happen every single time they come in, okay? So the reason why it's so important is because we need to ask your body to do a little bit more than it did before. That is gonna allow it to keep muscle, okay? So every time you set a number, you've gotta try and beat it. Now, your program is all laid out with sets and reps. You'll notice that reps come in a little rep window, okay? So it, m it might be, for example, eight to 10 reps. That's what it will say there, okay? So on your first couple of sessions, you need to pick a weight that you can do for more than eight. So if you end up getting to sort of like six or seven reps and can't complete it, at the moment that weight is a little bit too heavy for you. You need to step back a little bit. On the flip side of that, if you do a set and you hit the upper number, so in this case 10, and you finish 10 and you're like, oh, that was easy, right, that is it, that weight is dead to you. You may never lift that weight again unless you're warming up. So you have to go up to the next weight, okay? So you'll find that you can kind of get in between that eight to 10 rep scheme. Now, what happens is every single week, you need to try and beat what you did the session before, all right? So say, for example, day num like session number two, I complete 10 kilos for 10 reps. Bosh, I'm done, perfect. I've written that down in my notebook. The next session, I have to go up to 12s, okay? 10s just simply won't, won't challenge me in any way that is worthwhile and won't give me any reason for my body to change. So I have to do 12s. Now, this next session, 12s, it's a brand new weight for me. I might manage eight reps with good form. Perfect, pop those down, write it down in my little training log, eight reps ticked off, perfect. That's all we have to worry about for that day. I'll beat it because I've done a little bit more load than I did before. I come in for that session again the next time. I know that today I have to beat eight reps at 12 kilos. I have to. So again, I'll go and go and go and go until I get to nine reps. Perfect, that's fine. Don't quite make 10, but I do nine. That is progress, ticked off in my book. Next session, come back around to it again. I'm having it today. It has to be 10 or more. So again, I finished my set. I've done 11 reps. Perfect, write that down. The next session, I then have to go up to 14s because 12s will no longer provide any sort of meaningful stimulus to my body that will force it to change. So I have to do 14s and you start the process again. If you do that with every single exercise on your program, across every single set, you will be amazed at the extra amount of work that you do in no extra time. That stimulus on the body is so important and that is what you need to invest in massively in order to really get the results out of training in the gym. You have to. So, once you've watched this video, buy a little diary, buy a little training, literally go over to like Asda or other, other um, supermarkets are available. Go over to Asda, get a little training log, write down your sessions, write down your performances and beat it every single time you come in. You will thank us for it in four weeks time.